Okay, so here's my uh, Expedition Timer Event Edition. Here I'm going to place it uh, into the field, the starting gate. I got some uh, USB power here. I'm using a simple adapter where you know you just put a XT60 in there and then you get a uh, 5 volts. Timer in here and I'm gonna power it on. Okay, now the timer is on. Now I'm gonna pull the cable back to my computer. So you're already in the yard, I don't have to use wired connections, I just use Wi Fi, but uh, for demo purpose, I'm gonna use the cable. Okay, now I got the cable back. I'm gonna connect it back to my computer. Okay. This should get connection very soon. Okay, now it's connected. Now let's uh, get started practicing. First, let's uh, fly through, see what uh, sensitivity values we should we should set, and also the peak value. Okay, I think the peak should be somewhere here, and then. Uh, Awesome, yeah, let's give it a try. Holla should J. J twenty seven seven. J twenty four three. J2328 Skipping anomaly. J twenty two seventy two. J2276 Skipping Anomaly Yeah, one good thing about the timing system is uh, if you are crashed those time will not be counted into your into your lap times. You can set min and max lap times very easily to filter out these anomalies. J2278 
J2419. Okay, I was pushing 22s. Now it's 24, so I need to push harder. J2278. J2373. J2274. Skipping anomaly. J twenty two twenty eight. J3177 J3832 J2414 J2115 Hey, finally. Finally got Okay, let's finish the session. Let's take a look at our race case here. So here, since I'm the only one flying, you'll probably only see signals here. Oh, wow, this, is our, this is our first pack. Right? And I probably crashed and changed props. Second try, crashed again. And then third try. Where I got finally got a 21, 21 15. Cool. Just a demo to show you how easy it is to set up and run with uh, FBSM Event Edition. You just basically plug it, plug it in, and go. That's it. Cool. Thanks for watching. See you next time.